Weather tonight. Dave, what a mess out there already, huh? Oh, or getting worse. Yeah, we've had a handful of severe storms dropping some hail and really gusty winds in some areas. Take a look at the map here. Let's go to the biggest one. This one is the one that blew through Deer Trail all the way down here and it's making its way just clipping last chance out here. You see the little swirly cue there, the little red arrow. That shows me there's a little bit of wind shear in there. When we see that, you you might, if you're in that area, see some of the clouds moving pretty, pretty good around that area. Right now, it's an indicator that there is some hail in this storm. And in fact, we have seen anywhere from quarter inch to one inch diameter hail out of that storm system all the way uh, from last chance the area around last chance all the way back into the deer trail area. so that one's pretty big this one just dropped some rain in leader it's losing some of its punch but we're seeing stronger storms start to build a little closer to the front range here one just blew through campion here loveland you're probably seeing a lot of rain in here and some thunder there the heaviest of this uh, storm system right over i-25 and uh, highway 34 up here big big rains that may slow the traffic down uh, in that area up into the northern part of uh, of uh, some of those regions all the way up to Timnath and just south of Fort Collins up there and there's another storm over Jamestown and that will probably follow the same path up your way so we're not done yet there's quite a bit in the way of moisture and convection coming out of the mountains southern Colorado southwestern areas very dry we need rain down there unfortunately they are not tapping into this that closed low still over Nevada sending little bits of energy the one we had yesterday already in Chicago here's the one for today and we'll have another one going around the pike coming through Las Vegas tonight and then pushing into Colorado for tomorrow. So tomorrow afternoon again we could have more showers and thunderstorms around here. High temperature today made it to 60 degrees officially at the airport. The official low is 49 and out there now we're at 58 degrees with a north wind at 8. Humidity at 69 percent. Phil Curry is one of our weather watchers in Franktown and he was tracking that storm that was over Deer Trail and here's what his shot looked. Pretty ominous looking uh, thunderstorm building right over the highway out there. Now the future tonight does show these storms blowing up out over the eastern plains. So if you're watching all the way out here into Fort Morgan, Sterling, and in northeastern Colorado, I think all night long you could see some rain there. And we may even have some rain past midnight tonight here in the Denver metro area going on all the way through off and on through tomorrow morning. In the morning tomorrow, more fog, more drizzle to get the day started. And then in the afternoon, more showers and thunderstorms firing up. And look at that from Cheyenne all the way down to Monument Hill here. Some of those storms may be severe and in fact the area for marginal severe threat goes from Fort Collins into Denver all the way down to Pueblo out to Lamar and just touching Burlington out here so a bigger area could see damaging hail strong winds and one or two isolated tornadoes are not out of the question tomorrow afternoon across the eastern plains here so lows tonight 30s and 40s across most of our region and highs tomorrow pretty much where we were today a lot of 60s and 70s here across the eastern plains so my forecast tonight scattered storms some severe mainly east of town and and north of town. Fog will form up overnight and we'll be in the upper 40s and then tomorrow showers, scattered thunderstorms and only 60s tomorrow in the forecast, 66 officially. And then we pop into the 70s Tuesday through Friday. But look at that, Kathy, each and every day we have a chance of either isolated or scattered showers and thunderstorms. We sure do. All right, Dave. It's spring. <laughs> mm -hmm. Thank you. Well, the DU Pioneers lacrosse team played their 